Health is about human beings. Health is not just about combating pathogens. I'm Cesar Atuere. I'm an associate professor of philosophy at the University of Ghana and also ethics lead at the Masters in International Health and Tropical Medicine at the University of Oxford. The title of our project is Moving Beyond Solidarity Rhetoric in Global Health, Pluriversality and Actionable Tools. In many situations of health emergencies, there are appeals to international solidarity. However, what we find is that on the local levels, people do exhibit solidarity, whereas at the international level, appeals to solidarity have been generally ineffective. We saw that with the vaccines for COVID-19. So what we're trying to do is, first of all, understand what solidarity means to different people. And we do this by interrogating the people and the voices across different areas of the global South, Asia, Latin America, Africa, to find out how they conceptualize and live solidarity. And then, out of these, we are hoping to tease out an understanding of solidarity that is inclusive and at a second point, we will then work out how we can make actionable tools out of this in such a way that when there are appeals to solidarity, one, we know exactly what we are appealing to be done. And secondly, we can actually measure whether solidarity is being practiced and by who. During the pandemic, science and medical sciences made great advances in producing a vaccine in record times. What was lacking was were elements of governance, trust, distribution, and allocation of resources. And these are issues that have to be tackled from the social sciences, the arts, and the humanities. Because what can happen is that we may even have the best and most scientifically advanced tools, but if people do not want them, or they are not attuned to people's needs and priorities, and there is no trust, these tools will be ineffective in combating disease. Unlike many other research projects that sometimes require a lead to be from the global north, in our project, Welcome had no issues at all with the lead of the project being based at the University of Ghana, which is in the global south, and having collaborators from other parts of the world, including the global north. So flexibility, the capacity to listen and dialogue, and the broad conceptualization of health were the things that attracted me to the Discovery Awards as a way of shifting understandings.